and all these buyers every day, there is no reason that if, you know, unless you're not picking up your phone, there is no reason you don't make like 10K a day. You know, I mean, obviously you gotta wait for closing, but. But then you know, again, right, it's, spe it's speed. Then again, right, it's speed. It's Sometimes you might not be on, on the server or like during that time, it's, it's about speed to lead. So whoever calls it first gets the deal, right? So if there's like one lead and there are 50 people, it's like throwing throwing a piece of, 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 of meat into a pond of fish, the first one who catches it gets it, right? But yeah, so we're gonna, we're gonna be posting at different times throughout the day, um, just to kind of like, you know, keep everything good um, so that it kind of gives more opportunity for everybody. But also when it gets to those high amounts of members, we're gonna split it up. So, you know, Everyone you guys that are in there right now. And so basically if you buy it at $200, you're gonna be on the $200 team, right? So you guys will have your own set of leads for the day. And then it'll be like the people that bought it for 850, they'll be in a separate property leads channel. Um, and they'll get their leads from that section and they're different properties. So. We're, we are going to split it up. There is going to be ways to split it up. That makes sense. Um, so, you know, just depending upon the price that you get it at. And we're actually going to open our application um, if you want to work with us. Um, so let so me... we're gonna, I'm going to be posting the application link in there. Um, so that's, you know, you, obviously you'll be able to read the benefits, but just a little bit is like getting your own personal property leads um, every day. So I was just wondering. Um, nobody else. I was just wondering. So if we get a property that's on a, a property from Easy Leads under contract, um, do we? Um, it's requirement that we split a eighty twenty, right? Correct. Yeah. Okay. So whether you, either way. So either when you, you know, you can use your own leads, you can use whatever, but if you either use our leads or our buyers, one or the other or both then yes, you owe the 20%. Um, but the more deals that you make, the decrease in that percentage makes. So it's like your first 1,000 deals, which with easy leads is hella easy to make deals, right? We had people today making deals already, and it's not even 24 hours in yet. So it's like once you get your first like 500, 1,000 deals, then your percentage will go down, or my percentage, like, you know, it'll be 90, 10, you know, until you get all this stuff completely without paying us any commission. Because at that point for you, it doesn't matter if we get any of your commission because we have constantly new people coming in that's gonna fill that spot. So we don't mind losing out on your commissions. So that's kind of how that works. And that's how we run our, all of our, of our five discords. Um, Cause we have five discords worth of easy leads that, you know, 10,000 people are in each. So, you know, we we got a system that works, um, and we we know how to do it. So it's more so just about you know getting you guys to understand because everybody that's in there right now and all the other ones they're averaging like ten to thirty k a week um, at minimum. So it's you know it's great. Uh, yeah. Well, yeah. On that tomorrow, I'm on that. Yep. That's why, I'm, that's why I'm stressing because this is low key. You know, the the stuff that's listed in there is expensive. So, uh, you know, oh, and that's eat. why I'm like, you know, I want to get. I'm not trying to like push y'all in there just to spend y'all money, but when it goes up, you're gonna be thankful that you spent two hundred dollars on it. You're also gonna be thankful when you make like ten k in a week. You're gonna be like, shit, I got my money back and I got an extra fucking nine thousand eight hundred dollars. Sir. Grayson, I got a question. Y'all do counseling, right? I, I saw that counseling. Yep. So we're hosting a Q and A tomorrow um, at seven PM Central Standard Time, and then if you, you know, just send an emoji in there, and then I'll DM you, and we can schedule out a one on one. That basically either you'll do that with me or my partner, um, and we walk you through your first entire deal. Nice, bro. That is so smart. Y'all did that, bro. That's just. Uh... As I say, bro, y'all better y'all better pay that two hundred. It's not even just like how you said, just to take your money. It's just that in the future, when so everybody's in there making deals, you're gonna be crying like, bro, please, 
Let me do 200, bro, please. I, yeah, well, let me, I, let me know. I, I talk, let me know. I talk, I talk to her. I talked to Grayson about that, and he said 72 hours, guys. So, you know, so, I told him, like, I'm, I'm for, like, for real committing to this, and I want to buy his course. It's just I don't have to. Oh, yeah, I'm serious. Yeah. I told him I didn't have the funds until, like, next Wednesday. And he said, sure, I'll see what I can do if I can get to next Wednesday. And he said, yeah, sure, yeah I can do next Wednesday. Like, All right, but if um, you want to get it, I'll, for, like, for sure buy it. He's in the call. And, like, do you guys not see him or something? Oh, oh, yeah, Grayson. Yeah, what's up? Bro, can you and the guys, like, not see him or something? Like, what the fuck? I, I can see him just fine. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know what Bro, not because, like, he, bro, uh, my God, yeah. Box. Oh no, yeah, so thanks thanks for that, Grayson. I appreciate that. Yeah, no problem. Oh yeah. Oh I'm not sure who was in the call, but I think someone was in here when I was I like. I can't believe there are so there. few people in this call. There's being there's so, there's so much value being spewed in this in, in this call alone. Dude, this is normal, but this is nothing new. This is nothing new. Bro, we active, you know. No, trust me, bro. This Discord is gonna be dude. When everybody's like a millionaire and shit, there's gonna be values left and right. Left and right. right, left and right. Tight. The thing is, all the new people, I want them to still get right, but I want the OGs all to have something. You feel me? Like, I don't exactly. give a fuck. Exactly. Exactly. Like, the OGs. Like, you don't even got to be a millionaire. Just have six figures because I feel like we all came up together. Like, we graduated. Exactly. Exactly. Like, that's, it feels exactly. good as a, as a group. Of dogs, a group of people. We all was stressing, figuring it out. You know what I mean? Now we graduated. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. It's like it's like you know we all have our personal life, but this is where we come together and we succeed. All right, you feel me? Through sure. all this, we don't know what yes, each other sir. going through. Everybody yes, through sir. You went through some shit this morning. We don't know, but you gonna come here and we are gonna manifest and we are gonna get right. Simple yep. as that. Yep. Damn, yeah. Cass, what year? What year is that beat me? What year? Uh, yeah. sixteen. Shit, do I got that ambient lighting in there too? Yeah. Orange. Oh, that's fucking sick. Yeah, but I, I want to sell it. I want an M4. I'm not going to lie. But, like, that exact same body, a, though. That exact same body. I'm trying to see if I can get a G80 M3. He's doing a giveaway. Grayson's doing a giveaway. Hop on there. L like I said, I don't have the funds for anything. Oh, right, right, right. Plus, hey, Grayson, um, just, Grayson, nah, I'm not fucking... I'm a Beamer boy, bro. Shit. I'm not sure who was in the call with me, bro, but, like, I was making a phone call, and then I said something, and somebody was, like, dying. I forgot. I, I'm not sure who it was. But yeah. What well, happened? How about I say, when was it? What happened? I'll probably remember what happened. I, I was, I, like, I was calling someone, right? And then I was, like, I said something about me bending backwards for you or something shit. Like, oh, bro, what? Yeah, baby, I, hey, Yo, yeah. what? Yo, bro, what? No, 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 but, like, it was, it, was, it was in the it was in the script though. It was in the script. Oh, what oh, script it was on Joe's Joe's script. Joe's script. Joe's. Oh, oh, what? What the yeah. fuck? Yeah. Oh, yeah. What the fuck are you talking about? Let me tell you. Joe doesn't. Joe does not give a fuck if you make money. Okay, Joe just wants your fucking money. That's what's different with Easy Leads is because I don't give a fuck about your money. I got my own. But I'm giving you everything to make your own bag. Are you talking about Joe Riley? Yep. No, he's he talking about well, yes. But he's talking about himself guys and giving us the bag. Yeah. But 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 by Joe, you're referring to Joe Riley from Enterprises Elite. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Got it. He don't do shit but flunk money and try to make it seem like he give a fuck. I mean he like, he lives bro, like, he, he lives the, the Huh? He lives in a penthouse on like the twenty seventh, the twenty the twenty seventh floor of a store, the twenty seventh floor of a penthouse in in downtown Hartford, Connecticut, with his with his partner with his partner, uh, yeah, and um, he runs like what he does is like I think he like it's a pyramid I think it's a pyramid it's basically a pyramid scheme right he um, if you That's all it. right it's it's basically a pyramid scheme. I only use it for his contracts. I'm telling you, that's the only thing is valuable. I pay fifty dollars for a contract, and I'm not mad. I mean, I use it because it's simple. It's like it's it's simple. Oh. And what's good about it too? It has an inspection period clause on it, so 
Exactly. So you can back out of that motherfucker. Exactly. Wait, yo, what happens if you have that contract, but you're not paying the membership anymore? Then you. I'm gonna be completely honest, bro. I'm gonna be a hundred. I'm gonna be a hundred. <laughs> I'm gonna still use the contract. These motherfuckers so look, they don't give a fuck. <laughs> so look, look, I'm, uh, I stopped paying. I stopped paying last month, and I'm still in Enterprise League. I don't know how, but I'm still in that motherfucker. So I feel like if you if you cancel your membership, I don't even think they'll even notice and kick you out, bro. I'm still in it. I paid. Like, bro, that's months. how that's how dead that Discord is, bro. Exactly, and I still use your contract. That's the trash. Bro, that's what I'm saying, bro. Twenty thousand. That's what I'm saying, bro. And like, bro, this Discord's like the same price as that one, and this one's way more valuable. Way, yeah. way, yeah. way more. Yeah. Fuck those Discord. Do you guys have title companies in tur- and it, do you guys have like? See, I know you have uh, like cash buyers, but do you guys also have title companies and attorneys? Well, it depends on their zip code. Right. Uh, we, we're posting a whole list yeah. of all that. Right, because some... But some with their closing company, right? Some states are oh, title companies, states, and some states are... Att- so some states, you have to uh, close real estate through, like, through an attorney. Right. Uh, it all depends, because some title companies, they'll say that we have an escrow attorney or whatever. But if they don't, then you got to switch to a different one. But you can find them. It's like a needle in the haystack if they already have a list for it. Yeah. But um, you guys are going to be posting. What did you need? I have no title companies. You guys are going to be posting like uh, title companies um, and, and attorneys, though, right? In like the title company section. For easy leave? Yeah. You should, yeah, you should like make like a make like a separate channel of like local and nationwide title companies because right because it's not you have to choose the right title company if it's not a wholesale if it's not a wholesaler for the title company then that can destroy your deal because they won't they won't know how to do whole assignments so no, yeah, we, to, i already have a list I've, I've had a list for three years of title companies for every state so i am going to post that in there yeah. um, but i just like i said i want to get the members up um you know, before I add so much more. Got it, yeah. Because if I already pay there, then there's no incentive for anybody else to join. You know? Makes sense. I think... Yeah. Um... I'm just grateful that Grayson's giving me, like, like a, a grace period for extra time. Uh, is there... No, we all got things that are going through, but it's the fact that you're committed and you got a plan in place. Exactly. Lock in, brody. I just, I just need leads, bro. That's, that's literally all I need. For real. Hey, hey, Shad, how old are you? I'm 20. Do you have a car? Yeah. Do you work? Mm, yeah. What I recommend you do is, if, if you want easy leads faster, bro, get DoorDash, bro. DoorDash, dude, just DoorDash for like two days. You can get that 200 easily. Yep. Literally. How old is there, buddy? Uh, I'm 19. Like, bro, I reckon, bro, DoorDash is such an easy, like, oh, I need money now? Oh, shit, let me hop on DoorDash real quick. Fuck, I got DoorDash. Man. Dude, dude the easy way to get money to invest. Easy. And I got $10 million. <laughs> easy. Mm-hmm. Easy leads. How long have you been doing wholesaling for? Um, We've had easy leads up for about three years, and I've been wholesaling for four. That's cool, yeah. So, must probably. How have you been able to? Uh, and our net worth, our net worth is our net worth is about ninety three million dollars. That's a that's pretty good, man. How have you been able to scale up? So, like, like what systems have you been using? To, like, what did you do after your first deal? Like, what's the first thing you put your money into? Um, I invested it. Um, I invested it. So my first deal was an eighty thousand dollar deal. And I used that money. It was such a risk, but I used that money to do a fix and flip. Um, and wow. then after that second deal paid off, I got my real estate broker's license and I opened the LLC. And then I got started right away. And I printed out the Discord link and I printed out like about our company, what we do, you know, what it pays, 
what it includes. And I went to the library and I printed out like probably fucking 2,000 sheets. I folded them up and then I brought them and I handed them out to kids when they left school, like high schoolers. Mm -hmm. And then I would go and I would just put them in every fucking mailbox, every fucking mailbox. And then I sent out mass emails um, to anyone that I could find. Because uh, true people search, you used to be able to just look at a whole list of emails. Are um, these people you so tried? I just copied all. Are these people you tried to find to who you want, who wanted to sell, sell their house, or were you trying to sell your Discord? Yeah, I was just trying to get you know get members on, put people on to wholesaling, um, and then I also had a section, you know, at the bottom like, hey, if you want to sell your house, you know. Um, now, how did you but, how did you scale your wholesaling business? You like did you hire cold callers first? Did you get a dialing system, a CRM? Just trying to see how see how no, you so did. We, no, so we had we had people that joined. We had about like fifty people that joined out of everything, um, and you know, we first started off by just like. You know, you just basically what it is right now, right? So when you make a deal using us, we get a commission. Using that commission, which took a little bit of time, as well as I was wholesaling on the side, I used some of that money and I invested in a marketer, which I still use today, um, who's handling uh, Starfire and Easy Leads to this day. Um, and he got people at call centers. He got, you know, mass market emails going out. Um, he figured out a way to get every time that Zillow posts a listing that's by owner, it automatically gets emailed to him, um, and he's able to send that out. We got we hired VAs, so it was just like it took a while, but it was a slow process. That when it, when it worked, it worked good as fuck, and then when it didn't work, it still worked okay. Yeah. You know, so it was really just the call centers really weren't that good. Why? Because there's only so many properties. And with the call center, you know, you can train these people how to wholesale, but they don't know how to wholesale. Just Rather treat, as if you teach, had call, teach, call center, yeah. you know, if we, we had the call center, we first had them like, okay, we'll show you how to wholesale, right? And then you'll get them under contract and it's easy money, right? You just keep, keep getting contracts in. However, that didn't work. So... We switched over to a call center where it literally just, hey, are you interested in wholesaling? Do you want to join this Discord that teaches you and gives you everything you need? So we switched it from wholesaling to we're going to call random people to get to join our Discord. Now, we had people joining our Discord that didn't know what it was. They didn't know anything about it. That wasn't, they weren't even interested. And then they went to testimonials and saw people's million-dollar bank accounts, and they started and then they got like 100K their first two weeks and they were like, yeah, I'm gonna do this. So, and we had people anywhere from, you know, 16 years of age all the way up to in their 50s. So it was super, super open. And, you know, me and my partner, all we care about at the end of the day is that you guys are happy and healthy and, you know, that you're able to make your money in a way that's efficient and that, you know, is comfortable for you. Um, and like, in recommendations, like if there's anything you want different, you guys are the one using the Discord the most, right? So we want it to work for you. We want to see because different groups of people want different things. So, you know, we usually, that's why we have five Discords. They're all the same thing. They all serve the same function, but there's five different Discords for that. Um, because, you know, if we had everybody in one, it'd be too fucking much. So we split it up and, you know, our, our motto is like, we don't care about the money. We just want y'all to be successful. And we've carried that the whole time, but you know, we use the most basic, basic ways, you know, to gain popularity. Um, yeah. The most basic ways. So, you know, you could invest in like CRM and all that shit, but you know, it's the basic ways that, you know, just take it slow. Don't rush into it. Don't be like, you know, oh, I'm gonna build a website. I'm gonna, I'm gonna share all this. Like, slow down, because. If you, if you on your own can't make deals, what makes you think you can teach somebody else how to make a deal? So right. slow it down, perfect the craft, and then share your perfection. Uh, mm -hmm. Hey, quick question for you, Christian. Yep. Um, you said, you, you've been wholesaling for four years, right? Yep. How would you report that to your taxes? That's like 
the only thing I was always worried about. Yeah, I'm gonna post that because a lot of people are like that seems no. to be a common question. But you you file them like you would. Um, so we have a link where you can uh, fill out an I nine, and oh. so technically you're working for us, right? So it's like a typical job. Okay. Um, but you know, obviously, you still get that amount of money. But it's easier. It's easier going on taxes, and it's a legal I nine. So you are, you know, hired. Um, and but, that's if I'm in easy right? Correct. Okay. So we have we have that option. So that way, you know, on taxes, literally all you have to. It's super simple when you have an I nine or a W two, um, and with the I nine, you're able to obviously, you know, write off a lot more. Um, and that's what everybody kind of right, you know, my BMW that I bought was a write-off. You know, I, I made so much that it didn't even matter. So, um, you know, that's, that's kind of like the goal. That's kind of the thing is it doesn't, it's not like when you, when you get hired, quote unquote, we're not keeping you here. You're still doing the same thing. You just, you know, you technically legally work for us, but you know, in our eyes, you don't, you know, you're just you're doing this your same own business but it's just a secure way to file your taxes because otherwise it's super fucking messy because if you don't have a job and you're making this much money bro they could lock you up is gonna like, ask you a lot of broad questions. suspicion you know you don't want that so that's why we do offer that and that's one of the great things that like elite enterprise they don't give a fuck they don't care you know but we give outlets for every possible scenario um so IRS gonna be on your ass, boy. Boy, Blinky, that first check hit, they, that ankle monitor going off. Yeah, yeah. He's bribing the fucking, I'm bribing you. Boy, Blinky. Yo. Were you in the call when I was talking to someone over the phone? Not um, bad. I don't know, bro. I didn't hear me. I took a nap. What? Dude. My laptop died. Oh, bro. that's tough. But yeah, so so that'll be an option when you join, um, and I'll get that posted for anybody that wants to write it off. Yeah, so basically, it's, also have like a, it's, a it's like an I nine thing. It's like you just you just file it, and then like taxes are tax, the money goes like on your behalf. What's thing? Oh shit, MC, what's up, MC? Oh, what's up, um, yeah, MC? Okay. You can call me Will. My name so my, my, the... my name is Will. You can my, go ahead. My, my my username is mcpin71. But yeah, I'm um, MC, whatever you want to call him. But yeah, just um, so uh, taxes, um, yeah, because if you make a, a it's lot... It's basically going to be the same thing as when, if you got a job at McDonald's, it's going to look the exact same on your taxes. Okay. So it's, it's obviously just going to be a bigger, like, paycheck. But, I mean, people make that at you know, corporate jobs anyway, so it's not, like, unheard of. Yeah. Okay. okay. But it'll show up to them at the same way it would as if you submitted your taxes working at McDonald's with that I-9 form. Yeah, so is, are you, are you going to post, like, a, are you going to post, like, a module in Easy Leads of, like, how, of, like, how this whole thing works? Yep. Okay. Yeah, because... Yo, some God, of, cheese on the stick is crazy. When are you gonna? Will you also like post like a YouTube video or like a short little video and like kind of file it with the? Yeah, I can. Okay. And what if sure. what yeah. if um what if it's a deal that's not from a lead on here? What if it's like a lead that I found? So if it's a lead that you found, um, and you still use our buyer, we still get the twenty. But if you're in easy leads and you find your own property leads and you find your own buyers, then we you don't owe us anything. And I and I pay and I pay tax tax returns on on the on that money myself. Right. Okay. But if so, I so but that's if, why you know it's encouraged because I mean if you think about it like you know whether you use our property leads or you find your own doesn't matter. 
Um, but if you're always using our buyers, which are always on hand and there's a surplus of them, um, you know, if you, you know, that, that increases your chances of making deals per week. So rather than making one on your own and, and profiting 20 K, if you're making three on your own and still profiting 20 K or more with that 20% taken out and you're still profiting that same or more amount, it really, you know, it equals out. And then you're able to just write it off all in one sheet rather than being like, oh, yeah, I work two different jobs, you know, so. And okay. then you guys, this commission is just 20%, right? Yep. It'll never go higher than that. But the more deals that you make, the lower that percentage is going to go for individuals. That sounds okay, good. yeah, so this is where it's going to fit for me because, like, I, I just literally struggle finding leads. If I can, yep. if I get like a whole leads list for sell or sellers specifically, then I, help. not even, not even three at the moment, but I can, I can probably guarantee you like at least five or six. It's about uh, how quickly you can. Not in the whole day. It's about how quickly you can get to it. Yeah, that too. But I'm yeah, so like I said, there'll be. They'll be posted at all different times of the day. Um, so, you know, whether you're on in the morning or you just get on at night, there's always new opportunities. Um, they're kind of posted at random spurts all throughout the day so that you can, you know, best be prepared. Hey, uh, Grayson. Yep. So, so all, all we have to do is your workers give us leads. All we have to do is call them up, and get them under contract, and then find and then find one of your buyers. Yep. Yeah. So once you get it under contract, um, in Cash Buyers Local, you'll post the sale and agreement contract filled out. Once that's filled out, we'll give you a list of about ten buyers with their phone numbers and name and everything, their budget and um, where they're looking to buy, but. When you post your contract, we'll find buyers specifically for that contract. So, okay. you know, in cash buyers nationwide, it's just, you know, nationwide cash buyers, you know, they'll most likely yeah. take your deals, but having that ability to just submit your contract and get buyers that you know are going to take your deals, they're looking in that area. They, you know, they mainly work in that area. Um, yeah. So that's, it's a huge benefit. And like I said, you know, that allows you to make more deals. So you'll be making more money regardless of the 20%. And that's the one thing too, I don't like about elite enterprise is like 50% is a lot. Yeah. You know, if you got a 10 K sure. deal, you're only making five. That's not much, you know? So it, it, it's like, eh. So there, yeah. Okay. So when you're talking about like, they know that they're local, is it because they know the market better in that area specifically? Yeah, so that's where they do their fix and flips. That's where they're, you know, professionally located. Okay. That's like and then, their home and then, point. Okay. And then for for your channels that you have for like local cash buyers, is it like just a whole like one chan or a one text channel, say just national or national um, national cash buyers? So what do you mean? Like, is it an an announcement channel? No, so is it like I, I is it like a normal text channel, but like you have multiple chats of like different uh, of all states, or is it just like one whole thing? Um, it's kind of all over the place, but there's just like it's every day. There's like a huge chunk of buyers that get added in there, um, and they have like I said, they have locations, so it'll be their name, their phone number, the amount that they're willing to spend on your property, and then it'll say like nationwide and Texas, nationwide and, you know, Detroit. So it'll be nationwide and they'll have some, they'll have states. Um, so you could filter through those always. Um, but, you know, by getting the membership, you know, you automatically agree that, you know, 20% is there. And like I said, it'll go down as you make more deals. But um, yeah, you'll be able to make all that. So how much more down in commission would it go? Like by 5%, 2%, 10%? Yeah, so for, you know, you get your first 500 deals, it goes down 5%. Um, so then you'll be at 15. 
and then once you hit a thousand it'll go down to 10 so it's every 500 deals that'll go down um so you make 2000 deals and then you're done you don't have to owe us anything deals. and you still get access to leads and buyers the average okay, wholesale for, for a tax write off will we still write your will we still yep. do the i9s yep okay and you'll and put then also i am pretty sure you've got oh wait sorry sorry go ahead go ahead go ahead um yeah so basically or and again you'll be putting like um a guide on how to fill out the i9 like in a module in, in easy Leads, yep. right okay when's that going to be coming in yep um probably when we get a little bit more members okay. um just because it is it's the end of the year so if you're writing your taxes now you know you're not it's not a lot so yeah, i made um i made you don't you could just file that separate yeah, because this year I made two, I made two thousand dollars at a job that I had this summer, and then I made twelve thousand on my first deal, so I made fourteen thousand dollars so far, and hopefully I can get some more deals in before the end of the year. But yeah, it's yeah. Hopefully, I don't. Yeah, no, I'll it. definitely I'll definitely get there get there uh, get that in as soon as possible. Um, but like I said, I want to get at least like a hundred legendary members. That's like the sweet spot to kind of open everything up um you know and so you guys have early access so you know while you're making your deals you know share easy leads share starfire get everything out there um and by doing that it only benefits you um you know getting the referral link getting the special access role gives you access to the mls gives you access to one-on-one -on -one chat with investors so it's a really really great role um, and that's another way that we also market it. Okay. Uh, I have just two questions. Um, so f I am pretty sure you got this a lot already, but for the legendary role, it's only a one time thing, is that correct? Yep. Okay. And then second, um, what was my second question? Yeah, I'm sorry, brain fart. Um, oh, wow. I forgot. I'll come back to that one, but the first one is a good answer. Mm. All right. Do you have any other questions? Um... Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, if you want to ask your question first, I'll go second. It's not that important. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's not going. Uh, well, uh, I guess the second question is... Um, can anyone join your Easy Leads Discord, or do, do you have to, the people in Starfire, in, or, uh, what you call it? or do people in Starfire Wholesaling have to be enrolled in here first in order to be able to access your Easy Leads Discord? Yeah, no, it could be anybody. Um, most of the time it's going to come from Starfire, but um you can share the link to anybody um even if they're not in starfire because ultimately they'll be you know they'll be like oh starfire is also you know included so then they'll kind of migrate over there on their own um you know because you know our business is just you know we promote each other so okay but yeah i mean you can invite anybody anybody can join anybody's free to join um but like I said, it's, you know, you got to pick your membership, so. It's gonna get in Basically, like, what I recommend, what I recommend is if you're trying to invite a friend that, you know, um, doesn't know what the fuck he's doing, basically. Yeah, if they don't know what they're doing, get them in Starfire first. Yeah, yes, yeah, tell them to come here first so they can understand the basics. And then once they see how easy this is, they're going to see fucking easily. So they'll be like, oh, yeah, that's the next level shit. Bro, I think there's yep. a good fuck, bro. Because if you, if you bring a beginner to the easily, they're going to be confused as shit. So fucking confused. <laughs> okay. I think there's gonna be a fight, bro. This nigga, damn near, I'm JV with this nigga, bro. And he put as buyer, home sales easy button, LLC, bro. That's Enterprise Elite. I know. Wait, hey, oh, yes. so, so Cass. Sure. Cass. What's your name? My name? My name? Me, Shad, Shad. Yo, so I was calling a seller today, right? Because he was selling us like a townhouse and it was so dog shit, like everything got demolished and it was like a heavy gut clean, right? Uh -huh. So this dude, I, I literally did the comps and everything 
and then since it was a heavy gut thing, I off he was asking for forty seven. I told him, bro, I can only do ten. And this he was so baffled. I was like, bro, okay, I can call you back in like the next ten minutes and talk to your partner real quick about pricing. And I got back to him. I was like, all right, the only lowest or the highest I could probably go would just be like twenty. Twenty-five-five. I told him that's like something else that's like that's mm -hmm. something reasonable because mm -hmm. I would have to do a lot of the repairs and I'm taking care of closing costs. And then he said the same thing. Like he already has a guy or another buyer that for forty k or forty something k, forty seven. And he mm -hmm. said he was going to take care of closing costs because he's a real estate investor. I told him. Sir, to be quite frank with you, that guy is probably going to lowball you even lower than what I'm giving you as a reasonable offer. This guy's probably going to go even lower than the original price, which was 10k. But if he calls you back again, I'm like, and then that, like, there's no way he could have gone out of it. And he was like, he was actually like stuttering a bit. I was like, <laughs> that's where I got. Oh, wait, yeah. wait, 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 wait. So what's the ARV? Uh, it's like 60k. Oh, what the fuck? Not oh, 60. Fuck? No, not 60. Like, it will jump from 47,000 to 60. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, bro. Like, I, don't I, I, stay, I, I stay away from shit like that. I'm not gonna lie. And it needs a whole shit ton of repairs. Hell no. When I see something that's five figures and it needs a lot in repairs, bro, I usually stay away from that, bro. I'm not about to waste my time. That's how my I second deal. Just that's, to get fucking that's how my second. Yeah. Hell no. That's how my second deal collapsed. The house, the seller said that it needed, um, the back part of the house was deteriorated. So I estimated around a back part, just might need some repairs, give it around 50,000. But then my, I said, I sent my, my partner over there and, um, he like the, pl the whole place looks like, a, looks like a, 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 like a grenade went off, like two, like six grenades went off inside and like, like the house had to, like the house is would have to be like bulldozed down to the ground. So we had to cancel that contract. Nah, sixty days is crazy. Hey, the one thousand dollar man. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> how much have you how how much have you guys made on here so far? Like get like go. Th tell me each. Tell me. Tell me each of you. Tell me how much you made on 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 here. Zero. I reached my first six. I lost money. I put like an earnest money deposit and then I backed out. So the, the, the oh. seller got the money. So I'm negative right now. Bro, what? <laughs> what wait, the fuck? Wait, 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 what? <laughs> what you mean, what? I want to repeat that. What you mean? What you say, nigga? That's what. What you mean? I put down the earnings it's... money deposit of like a million dollars. All right, bro. It. All right, no, no, just stop, just stop right there, bro. No. no. <laughs> I made, I made ten point two million. Word. Yeah, it's pretty good. On a stick, man. On a stick, bro. He can buy the, he can buy, he can buy the bodega. Grayson, how, <laughs> Grayson, I mean, what? Can buy us. What what's what's your whip, Grayson? What's your whip? What do you mean? What kind? Like, like what? What's your car? Yeah. Oh, I uh, I drive a nineteen ninety two Mazda Miata. Well, oh. That's classy, nice and classy. Um, have you? Yeah, like, I just Miata? it's taken apart right now in my garage. I'm respraying it. That's pretty cool. Have you um? Use any of the money what's to like. What's up with the fucking brand new BMW you giving away? You just said fuck it. It's, it it's away. sitting in my garage. I took it to one show, put two hundred miles on it, and then I just ended up hating it. So I don't drive it. It's just in my you garage. It? Damn. Yeah. I don't like oh, fucking yeah. BMWs. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Hey, Damn. Um, you know what? Tristan? <laughs> hey, I think I can get it tomorrow. Actually. What? You're the easy leads, the legendary rule. I was about to say, boy, I was about to spend money on the Beamer, not easy leads. I know. What the fuck? I was like, what the fuck? No, the, yeah, no, I. I was think... about to say, bro, I should leave the car at that point. Right? <laughs> 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 I was about to say, bro, I should leave the car at that point. Right? <laughs> <laughs>
I was able, okay, so. Asmo's gonna I, drop a fucking bag for that Beamer. Hey, I, 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 shit, I probably would, I ain't gonna lie. I probably would. Wait, like, so, the end, I probably would. Kaz is gonna spend his bag on the last fucking day. Wait, Kaz, so what's the like, like, How does the uh, info entertainment system look like on your. Um, what? Start a little red down here. I said, I said, how's your infotainment system on that 2016? Um, what do you mean? What are you talking about? Infotainment system, the little fucking screen that's in the middle of your car. Oh, you're talking. Oh, what about it? Like it's good. It's a regular. It's like, like every other. Does that have Apple? Does it have like Apple CarPlay or do you have to like no, Bluetooth? No, no, I have to. Have to. Uh, uh, that's true. No, I don't okay. even do fucking Apple CarPlay. I'm gonna be honest. I don't fuck. Yeah, no, Grayson. I think I'll be able to get it tomorrow or this one sick. All right. Sounds good to me. I mean, it only benefits you, so. I know. I just, like, all I, need, all I need is leads, man. I've been, like, I kid you not, the past, like, two weeks and a half, like, nonstop calling, but, like, like nothing good. So, so there's definitely like, enough of those. There's definitely enough leads in there. So, Grayson, yeah, thank please, God. Tell me, please, please tell me, what's wrong with Beamers? Nothing. I just, <laughs> I don't, I just don't like, like, how you know their cars are built like my car is 32 years old dog and that motherfucker is still going like no issues whatsoever it's a manual i'll be drifting that bitch it is so fucking fun like yeah. like i just i love jdm cars i don't have a problem if you uh, own a beamer i just don't want to own one <laughs> so like it, i would never it. i would never spend my money on that shit again ever i mean great yeah. get an e30 and three Nah. I probably if I'm gonna get a BMW, it's gonna be a uh, E30. That's it. Yeah. E30. What, what other car? What other car? If you're, if you're gonna get a sports car, brother, I think you should get a um, A90 Super if you're like that into. Yeah, no, that's on my fucking wish list. I I have a GTR a Nismo from Japan. It's in my garage too. I never drive oh. that bitch because I'm trying to keep her nice. Keep her nice. Yeah. Yeah. Damn, what, what year is it? What year? Uh, I think it's a 91. Ooh. Yeah. yeah hey, hey, hey Grace, my, my, goal, my goal is to drive this by 2024. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I, I feel like I can do it. This. Right here. Look at my screen. SVJ. Hi. <laughs> Mad shit. Honestly, bro, yeah. like. Lamborghinis are okay, I don't know, but like, if I were to get a Lamborghini, I'd still get a, like, a Ford from Monte, it was... Nah, fuck that, I want this exact one, word for word, bar for bar, color for color. Why not rim on you, Nah, 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 I want the SVJ, this exact color, look at them fucking seats, bro, that's the next level shit. It's not convertible, is it? Yes, it's convertible. Oh, it how is. Yeah, how, how, yeah, how you expect the host to see me, you know what I'm saying? Those <laughs> are type shit. You gotta get... <laughs> that's crazy, bro. dog. You, I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get like a GAM3. You gotta get like a, a GAM3? you gotta like you gotta get like a big car that can fit a lot of women. Shit, nigga, let me, let me, yeah, let me like get my mom's minivan. Track hawk. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, bro. A Brab, a Brabus. I should get a TRX. G63 Brabus. Nah, fuck that, Escalade V. SVJ, shit, nigga, if I do. Don't be taking my shit, Kaz. What? Oh, the Escalade V? Yeah. Bro, you, bro, that, you and Hector... That's the dad bro, truck, you, bro. You, you and Hector have the truck. same taste. You and Hector have the same fucking taste, bro. Every car that comes out of your mouth. That's me and Hector, them boy. What's happening, Hector? Man, he's muted right now. He's nah, like, bro. What you call it? A fucking Escalade V, bro? Nigga, you're going to be going to the gas station like every day or two. And I'm going to love it. Nigga. <laughs> 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 Fine. Gas prices don't matter when you're rich. <laughs> For real. I'm gonna burn a gas tank every day just because. <laughs> no, bro, you know what? I'll be right back, y'all. All right, for sure. Uh, All right. Nah, dude. Honestly, like, I wanna. Mm -hmm. Shit, I might get him a McLean though. Bro, but I'm gonna I'm gonna keep it a buck, it bro. If you're gonna go super, you might as well go lamb. 
At least, you know, only, unless you want to be Ferrari. He won. The, they all look the same, though. That I, or I get a look fucking same. Or I get a. You got a, what is a seven sixty five? Isn't that what the no? It's a seven eighty. The biggest one. Seven sixty five belt or some shit like that. Yeah, yeah, I think I don't know if I got my numbers wrong. Uh, but I don't I, at least remember the seven sixty five. Shit, bro. Honestly, nah. Actually, if I were to get a, like a really good hypercar, it would be like a F eighteen Spider Porsche. No yeah, yeah. word though. That was different. No, I think it, it's so fun. I, I raced it on the track one time. Dude, I'm dude. I'm hopping. Oh, really? I'm hopping on that SVJ. I don't give a fuck. I'm hopping on. What's is that? The, is that your main goal? Is just to get that SVJ? That nah, it's not the main goal, but shit, uh, I'm on that. I'm on it. I don't give a. What kind of what? Pla- what kind of places would you want to like travel to? Like because like with your money, when you have when you start when you start making lots of money, you wouldn't want to be like sitting in the U.S. like all year. You want to be like traveling around the world. That's right. Am I on private jet? Uh, pro- you probably my have to be like super jet. rich to, to do, do that, but probably like, yeah, probably like while well, while well, all my dude, I'm in my college dorm right now, and all of my all all the people in my college dorm are paying a hundred grand for flight trading lessons, and or or they're going to be like working in an office for forty years. But meanwhile, the, the goal is in five years, I'm going to be like hiking in the fjords of like like in the the frozen fjords of norway or on the fucking beach in fiji or whatever well or in in, in a fucking club in singapore those are like some really good like adventure food. or in santa barbara because there are lots lots of lots of lots of beautiful girls in santa barbara santa barbara california dude you got your eyes set on the prize my nigga Oh yeah, um, bro, Derp, where the fuck is Sweet at? Where's Sweet at? Yeah, um, he's probably he had like he had like hella leads. He was probably doing that. Oh, it's ten twenty seven. Right? It's, it's like the middle of the night here. Like, they can't believe there are yeah, no people calling. Yeah, no one's gonna answer. People, some people, aren't, people aren't gonna pick up the phone. It's twelve That's for just, me. I, he's probably doing that and then. Wait, where do you live at, fucking Cash? Where you living? I'm in, I'm in, Michigan, the, I'm on the West Coast. I'm in Arizona. Oh, uh, I'm in, in fucking, I'm in California, bro. But, uh, <clears throat> what's it called? I'm in, I'm, I'm in Illinois right now, close to dirt. Yeah, you have to have a real estate license in order to hold, you have to be a realtor to hold still in Illinois. No, I'm just lying. No way. Yeah, I, yeah, I was going to say, Illinois, you need to be a real estate agent. And also Oklahoma. Nah, for Illinois, you could do one deal before you need a brokers. Yeah, but then Oklahoma, yeah, you have to, you have to, you have to be a realtor in order to do a wholesaling. Have you heard like, have you heard, have you heard the news of NAR and like there's like, there's like a huge lawsuit in in National Association of Realtors against for like a group a group in Missouri filed a complaint, and that that the realtors um are, are like raising like the the asking price. And service prices of the services, so that um, the sellers are overpaying. So they faced a huge lawsuit of like one point eight billion dollars. So many real estate experts are saying that this could be the end of realtors. About that? Wait, 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 wait! I dead ass heard about that. Repeat that again, low key. Yeah. So um, the National Association of National Association of Realtors. They um, we just had like a big lawsuit against them for one point eight billion dollars because a group in Missouri filed a, like a complaint that like realtors were like taking advantage of sellers and making them overpay on their listing. I heard about this. Yeah. Then they end up getting sued too. Mm-hmm. So if this is the end for realtors, is that good news for wholesalers or like? Well. Yeah. I don't know. No, wholesalers can also have a risk. It would be it would be the end of wholesaling on market for sure. But um, because whole because in an off market transaction in wholesaling, there's no realtor involved. It's just it's just you, the seller, the, the cash seller the, the, the cash buyer, and a title company. But like, wait, how the fuck does that affect wholesaling on market when for sale by owner is nothing to do with realtor? Well, because on market is when you will like try to wholesale a property listed with an agent. That means you have to um, work with the real estate agent in order to close a deal. And also, um, 
there are lots of gurus on the internet saying on YouTube saying wholesale on, wholesale on the MLS. Um, but the problem is the realtor controls the the whole deal, and they often require an earnest money deposit of like five percent asking price or even ten. And, That's why off market is always better. Yeah, and they use their title company and their state approved broker contracts, which is not also always wholesaler friendly. And if you try to say, "Oh, well, I'll just get the I'll just get the money from my from my buyer, and I'll do it after the after the inspection," like they're not gonna they're not gonna be fooled. They're gonna know exactly what you're doing because they've seen like. And also, on market is like very competitive. That's like where all the newbies go to because it looks easy. And everyone wants to sell, and but um, yeah, but it's a lot harder than a lot harder than it seems. But yeah, this this lawsuit is I don't know what's going to do, but but if it's going to, it's I don't think, I don't think it should affect us off market off market wholesalers, but um, those who are who, those who are doing the on market model, I think are going to face a, a significant change. So, okay, who, I know this is a bit off topic, but, um, when, in Easy Leads, right, you guys get, like, motivated sellers, right, or does it give you a list of motivated sellers? Um, the, oh, the, the most, wait, what, I said in Easy Leads, um, do the leads that they give you for sellers, are they motivated yes. sellers? Yes, yes, they were already pre-contact. Ah, uh, okay. And then how do you claim it? I, I know it's like something You have to react to it. You have to react uh, to it. Speed you know, all night long, That Discord is worth so much more, bro. Holy shit. Yo! Chop cheese! I got a contract and I'm like fucking 20, 30 minutes and I was playing the game, bro. I was even trying. <laughs> Dude, yeah, no, like I'm paying it tomorrow. If it's seriously that good, yeah, I got their, yeah, I got their big guy JV bro coming. The thing I got this house for twenty, bro, and this house is a hundred and fucking. Where's it at? It? Yo, it's Mikey. Yo, where's Michael at? Michael Rowe. JV yeah. calls. What up? What up, baby? What's going on with your JV. name? What do you mean? What's going on with my name, baby? Is that one I got? <laughs> Chopped was, cheese fag. One K fag. Chopped cheese fag. Mikey fag. Shady dick. My name, God, God, God. What do you mean? That's tough. Yo, <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, y'all so bad. Hey, what the fuck? Hey, my name is Hey, my name Oh, hell no. Oh, oh, hell, 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 Oh hell, oh, hell no. no. Oh, hell oh, no. Hell <laughs> <laughs> hell no. Hey, Casmilius. Hey, Casmilius <laughs> Maximus. Change my name back. Hell no. See, I ain't gonna lie. I might keep five keys and 1K. I might keep 1K. <laughs> yeah, 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 nigga. Yeah. Matter of fact, matter of fact, I'm a, hey, I'm when Sousa joined back, I'm gonna call him the fucking, fucking dirty <laughs> platinum nigga. <laughs> Dirty we gotta got close that out, bro. We gotta close that Mare. out. Mare. Mare. Bro, that's crazy. I might fucking close three deals this week, bro. That's fucking crazy, dude. That that shit is fucking wild. Did you get them all from uh, Easy Leads? Yep. Yeah, bro. So awesome, man. I'm on that. Not word though. Yeah. I'm gonna have to, tomorrow is the first day I'm gonna officially like because I I I was like checking out checking everything out today and and, and checking out prop stream but yeah tomorrow it's um I'm gonna be uh, getting these deals locked up because but why you pay why you pay a hundred dollars for prop stream that shit is free for seven days yeah um I was less struggle because because the seven day free trial the problem with it. Is um prop stream has much more. You can't skip trades. No, 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 no. The problem with this is that like if you search up too much properties, they lock your account. You gotta fucking call them. And that shit's That's what happened to me yesterday. The stupid thing is, you only get ten thousand downloads, and um, um, let's see, and uh, what else? Um, yeah, it's, I I only use you it have for to college. pay for skip tracing. 
Yeah, it's like twelve cents, but I I you pay. What you call it? I um only use it for comps. Now be smart. Because you know like, what? It's, uh, so, it's super easy to use for comps. Like I saw prop or prop wire, and then Redfin. I like I tried using that. The only thing the only thing I use prop option for is comps. Yeah. Hi. Yeah, it's not terrible, but like, it's not terrible. Yeah, it's like, a, yeah, it's just not terrible. I try cancel. You know how like, if you don't cancel the day before your trial ones, they charge it on your account, right? Yeah. So, yeah. I tried, I tried canceling it the day before, and they was like, oh, they said something like, oh, why are you leaving? And then they give me an extra seven days. Oh yeah, that is true. Yeah. Oh, better. Maybe I'm about to do that and do that again and do that again and do that again. Catch <laughs> 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 on. Oh, no. And then what you gonna do? All right, all right, I'll pay, I'll pay, I'll pay. Do that again. That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you're closing, you're closing three deals. So like, how you're closing three deals tomorrow? When did you get those deal? When did you get those contracts signed? Because it takes time. It takes. Talking to me? Or are you talking to... What's that? You talking to me? You talking to um someone else? Um, I, I heard that um someone 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 said I forgot who, but they got three deals. Mikey got three deals for Easy Lead. I got three deals. I got one deal from Easy Lead and two other deals just from me searching. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So the process like, is, is sometimes they want to, they have their attorney go through it and it takes like two to three days. Yeah, usually it takes well, a, as as it, the standard time for a wholesale deal to close. It's like a month. You get like it's like thirty days from the, like thirty days out, and then it's like a fourteen day ex- inspection period because um, title needs to do their work and stuff. Make sure title is free and clear, th- things like that. Yeah, usually it's sometimes it's like easy as soon as as soon as um. You're on the phone with us, with, uh, with the person he or she is, um, Asia. You just gotta you sound nice. Who's Asia? Sound like a friend. That's what, I, that's what, that's what I did with this, with this nigga shit. And she said, oh yeah, I like it. Yeah, he's for sure winning here. He's still making money. He's gonna have enough money, blah, 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 blah. Wait, so how much making, cool. how much money in total are you making off those, like, three deals? A trillion. Off, off one deal, I'm making 34. Off another deal, I'm making like 25. And then off another deal, I'm making, uh. Ooh. Yeah, so the, happened. so, yeah, so yeah, his, uh, yeah. as soon as he closes one deal, his ankle base is going off. <laughs> yeah. I closed my and first like, <laughs> Oh, yeah, but hey, like, um, FBI open up on this nigga, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, FBI open up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, on this nigga. Yeah, also, contract or enterprise? Uh, enterprise contract. Yo, can they do anything though? Like, after you stop paying? The thing is, bro, the thing is, there was was our boy having a problem in here legit this morning. He was talking about that the title company was asking for the EIN number, I think it was. Uh, yeah. What's that? It's just, it's mostly well, because the prize of lead is there technically. It's like, it's negotiated to get So, how would you get the EI number? You gotta ask Joe yeah. ass, but that's not happening. Do they frequently ask for that? Or? No, actually, Nobody. that was the first time that I had somebody ask me for that shit. Is there anything Joe could actually do if you're still using it without pain? Yeah, like just, but, but I fucked up and put his own company at first. That's why I was like, oh shit, I didn't pay attention. You gotta put your name? I didn't know you could, but I talked to a, um, a real estate agent, not an agent, but I talked to an escrow attorney at a title company. They said it really doesn't even fucking matter. You can put your name, but if it have any tax liens or anything like that, it will be accounted for to yours, but for the most part, you're fucking straight. You're just a sign, you're the signer of a contract. It's not like you're signing off on anything. Yeah. So he put me on game. He's looking because I really should have paid for his little conversation just because, you know, it's an attorney talking to me for free. That, that never happened. Oh, but so you gave me a free consult? It, it turned out to be a free consult because I called the title company and I had a, a simple question type shit because I was like, hey, I'm trying to close with you guys. Um, I just had a question about my document. 
that led to I really got a free attorney call because he gave me insight saying, oh, you don't even have to put that. You can just put your name. You hear what I'm saying? Mm, okay. Right, right. So that gives y'all the leeway to look. You don't have to put home sales, whatever the fuck. You just put your name. So, bro, that, that's so, like such relief, bro. Yes, bro. I, I promise you I was so happy. So for the EN number, the, the dude that was like asking you about it, mm-hmm. what, what what happened next after if you don't have it? Oh, you also got to have an operator's agreement. That's as well. It's like a little document that just says you're an authorized signer of Enterprise Elite, and he has to sign off on that too, which is why I feel like Enterprise Elite is a scam because they didn't have that shit at all in a Discord. They didn't say nothing about it. Wait, since when the fuck was this? No word. I'm not going to argue. Yeah, I was about to say it was this morning. I sent it into the um the chat, and then I also I don't know who I was talking to. It was just a few people. It was not too many. Maybe like four people in here. Wait, what happened? Maybe about ten o'clock in the morning or so. I was in this. I don't know. I was about to say that. Yeah, you know what happened then. But yeah, it was like I was a uh, Impora Title Company. Uh, y'all can look them up on um. Uh, just the web or some shit because I was trying to do that sale what we're doing right now Blake, in Georgia I was just the same exact thing and um they just they wasn't fucking with it they was like hey look you gotta have an EIN number if you're working under somebody it's just how it is and you need an operator's agreement I don't know what the fuck and what state did you uh, do how'd you get that uh, oh I did not oh hell no that's why I was like I hit Blick ass up. I was like look man I was like I need to get JV on this shit I can't even move it right now. I was like, but I just want to get it going. It was a steal. Like, I got the property for twenty. Yeah, it is a steal. For that crib, that crib for the price right now for the heavy, the full gut is one fifty. You got it for twenty. One fifty k. So that's what I'm saying. So what's the JV gonna do? What the, the fuck? I, I think I get forty something. And he get like thirty something. You, no, you know, you get the no, no. What did he? What no, did the like, how is that gonna help? That problem? Right. I'm finding him up. You already got a buyer? You said what happened? You got a buyer already? No, right? No, no, no. That's what I need. I already got the shit under contract yeah, from the seller. I need a buyer. Wait, so what the fuck? I can, find a, I, can find a, I can find a title company too if you want. Oh, well, yeah. I mean, you could get, yeah, I'm about to say, whatever you do, that's cool. I mean, I know it's how to come me too, but if you got one, say, let's go ahead and rock with him. Wait, that doesn't kind of answer. That doesn't kind of. But what question oh, you got though? You asked your question. You asked him. him no, a the the nigga, the nigga with the en, the en. Oh, so that's what happened the, to him? What happened to him? Oh no, no, no that, that's that's um, that's still me. But I'm just saying they asked oh, before oh. he got it. Who's but they? Was like, Who's was they? The Emporium. Emporium. So Emporium. why why you, so why'd you have to JV? Why didn't you just find another title company then? No, 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 I didn't JV because of them. I JV because I wanted to get the property off regardless. I didn't want to keep wasting time finding the cash uh, buyer. Auto company was just something that threw me off because I was like, wait, I ain't never asked for a guy yet. Pause. So you got a, a contract signed and you automatically went to a title company? I was looking for title companies just to go ahead and have one like lined up. But when I do have the cash buyer, I can just go straight into it. But when I did call them and try to, you know, just be proactive about the shit, they let me know, like, hey, look, you have to have an EIN. Because I went ahead and told her what was going on. She was like, oh, yeah, we work with wholesalers, but you have to have an operator's agreement and EIN. I was like, uh, okay. okay but like, well, so how are you going to fix that problem? Oh, I'm not. We just don't use that title company because that's not the case with all title companies. That's what I was trying to tell her. I was like, I haven't experienced oh. that problem. Before. See, that's all you had to say. See, now we get it. That's, bro, okay. that's all we were trying to get out of you is, oh. Oh, um, <laughs> so that's, it. that's so all we were asking. Fixed, so you fixed the problem? By bro, you fucking scared me, cuz. I ain't even gonna lie. Oh, yeah, no, no, no. No, no, no. Word. That was so crazy because of enterprises. And that's why I was like, I got put on because the attorney, the actual escrow attorney, told me I didn't even have to put home sales either, but I could have just put my fucking name and still use this enterprise elite contract. They don't give a fuck about what it has on the header. That doesn't fucking matter. The header don't mean shit. That's why I did not know. I was like, oh, fuck. You feel me? Like, I thought I had to redo the whole thing. No, you can use the whole enterprise's contract and still just put your name right where it says buyer and be fine. You don't have to worry about fucking shit. Okay, so you just, to solve the issue, you just need to use them. Yeah, simple. simple. Uh, that's, 
<laughs> like, that, okay, that, that makes so much sense, nigga. Okay. Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, bro, what the fuck? I was like, what do you mean you're confused? I was like, yeah, you just don't. <laughs> like, you just put your name. <laughs> I was like, bro, did you fucking use him or not? Like, yeah, like, and then you were talking about JV. I was like, what the fuck is JV? Oh, no. JV was so totally different because we was kind of headed up now. <sighs> I was like, yeah, dude, like, being cast for Nah, but the percentage is, um, 35, 65. You get 65, I get 35. Yeah, that's okay. is. How would we file our, how would we show our, um, proof that we got our deal too easily so we can give them our 20%? Do we show them at the HUD or the bank statement or both contracts? Probably both contracts, I think right? you just you wire. Just, you just gotta be faithful. You just gotta be faithful, and... Yeah, you saw on the wire screen, the wire transfer, you said. I remember him saying that. And yeah. then how would you transfer? How would you give them the... Yeah, cash out. Cash out. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yo, Which yeah, makes sense. Yeah. Hey, you know what's so useful about that? Uh, by Grayson, like, he, he explained it, too, about how to file taxes. For that, for that, he said he's gonna have... There's a thing called I-9 form. So it's like basically like you doing just like a normal job, like a retail job or something. <clears throat> because you're working, it it says that you're working under easy needs, but that's what that's what the government will see. But realistically, you're just working for yourself. But then All again, but then again, if you um do your own deal, like your own seller, you're your own buyer, those that means then own, that you have to pay taxes on those. Yeah. Yeah, you you have to do it by yourself. You're not using. I ain't uh, doing shit. I'm paying for it. I'm paying for a bitch to do my time. I don't give a fuck either, nigga. <laughs> Yo, um, I'm gonna even, no, even file my taxes, nigga. Fuck. Well then, then I go, then I go, then I go, then Uncle, then Uncle Sam's gonna come knocking on your door and he's gonna take you to jail. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nigga, he's gonna be asking for you, nigga. He's like, come here, boy. Nah, but yo, if you make enough, if you make enough money, bro, you can you can end up getting a free car with with your taxes. You can write, you can you can do write offs. You, you can get tax write off, yes. But how would you wait, that's, that's the thing I also want to ask you about. I want to do that as a tax write off. I, for, I forgot what it's called, but when you make if you make enough money, bro, and you gotta pay a lot of tax. Like, tax you can, you can up, or you can up, making, you But what would you up, label? What would you label? The car as I know you can't say I'm not sure if you can say a company car, but how how would you live with that? You can just get it. You a person. It could be a personal car. You, they, they, the tax that the you if you, you goddamn either if you have a bitch working for you or anything, mm -hmm. they say get a car for you not to pay as much back on taxes. So you, it, she tells you a variety of what cars you can get. Who does? Either if you have a person doing your taxes or if you find that yourself. No, 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 you said, you said a person will look for a car for you. Who, who is No, that? no, no, you, Oh. So, so that's if you have someone doing your taxes for you. They'll look uh, what car you can get without having to pay a single dime. It'll just be straight from your taxes. Oh, so, okay, so a person that follows your taxes, you just ask them about cars. You should yeah. Your taxes. Oh. That's if you make a, that's if you make a lot. How much is a lot? Mm, hey, uh, hundred thousand. Kesmel, I just put. Kesmel, I just put in um, the testimonials, the screenshot of my of my first wire transfer, into the uh, win section. So you can go. Ahead. Oh, you did. Let's see this. You just go in. Not paid enough. Where is it? I'm gonna give you the rule right now. 